Unit 5. Shopping. Track 31. Page 48. Activity 3. Listen and circle. What does Maddie buy? How much is that swimsuit, please? It's $19.50. And how much are those sunglasses? They're $15. May I buy the sunglasses, please? Yes, of course. Track 32. Page 49. Activity 5. The prices in Activity 4 are wrong. Listen and circle the correct price. 1. How much is that wallet? It's $29. 2. How much is that bracelet? It's $12.50. 3. How much is that handbag? It's $19. 4. How much is that jacket? It's $212. 5. How much are those sneakers? They're $42. 6. How much is that umbrella? It's $25.50. Track 33. Page 50. Sing. The jacket's too short and the collar's too light. That hat's too expensive and the size isn't right. Track 34, page 52, activity 13. Listen and check the ads the boys talk about. Hey, Tom, there's an ad for a bike here. Great. My old bike is too small now. Can I see the ad? Here you are. Thanks. That bike is too big. I'm only 140 centimeters tall. What about that skateboard? You don't have a skateboard. The skateboard is $38. It's too expensive. Hey, look. Those video games are cheap. Wow. 20 games for $17. I want to buy them. Good idea. Can I play the games with you? Track 35, page 53, activity 17. Listen and write. 1. What do you want to do, Jack? I want to go sailing. I have a warm jacket, my sunglasses, and sailing shoes. 2. What do you want to do, Pete? I want to go to dance class. I have dancing shoes, a t-shirt, and baggy pants. Three. What do you want to do, Sally? I want to go horseback riding. I have long boots, tight pants, 
and a hard hat. Track 36, page 54, activity 19. Listen and write the prices. What does Jenny buy? Hello. I like this wetsuit. How much is it? It's $200. Oh. And the goggles? How much are they? They're $40. $40. Oh. What about these boots? How much are they? The boots are $95. They're new this week. Right. Um, how much are the shoes? They're $64.99. $64.99. Oh. And that scarf? How much is that scarf? It's $30. It's very long. Yes, it is. Okay. And how much is that hat? That hat? It's $9.99. I love it. May I buy it, please? Yes, of course. Track 37. Page 56. Activity 25. Listen and write. Whose are these? Okay, these clothes were here in school last night. Whose are they? First is this dress. Whose is this? It's mine. Good. Okay, here you are, Maddie. Next, whose umbrella is this? That's mine. It's new. It was very expensive. Okay, be more careful, Dan. Right. Next are these shoes. Whose are they? Emma, are they yours? No, they aren't mine, but that hat is. They're my shoes. Thank you. Okay, here you are, Robbie. Thank you. And here you are, Emma. Thank you. Track 38, page 57, activity 26. Listen and write. My clothes. My favorite t-shirt is white with small letters on the back. It's really cool. My favorite shoes are my sneakers. They're red and black. I don't like my winter boots because they're old-fashioned and my summer sandals are too small now. I like my school uniform. I really like the jacket. It's green and gold. They're my favorite colors. Unit 6. Party Time. Track 39. Page 58. Activity 3. Listen and check the true sentences in Activity 2. Hello, Dan. How was your weekend? Hi, Mrs. Baker. It was great, thanks. Yesterday was my birthday. I'm 12. Really? Happy birthday. Did you get any nice presents? Yes, I got a new basketball. And Robbie gave me some cool sneakers. My birthday party was fun. All my friends were there, and of course they sang happy birthday. What about your cousins, Saskia and Ali? My cousins were on holiday in Hawaii with my aunt and uncle. But my grandparents were at the party. There were some games in the garden. But it was rainy yesterday. Yes, later it was rainy, but we played a lot before the rain. After the games, we ate pizza and cake. Sounds great. Did your mom make the cake? No, Maddie made it. She gave it to me as a present. It was good. Track 40, page 60, activity 7. Listen and match. Hi. I'm Annabelle. December was a really fun month. There were lots of parties. My cousin Taylor's birthday was on December 2nd, and I went to her party. Then, on December 11th, it was my mom's birthday. The dance show was on December 13th. That was a lot of fun. Then, I went to my soccer club party on December 17th. 
And there was a party at school on December 20th. And of course, on December 25th, it was Christmas Day. And there was a big meal with all my grandparents, uncles, aunts, and cousins. Track 41, page 60. Sing. Track 42, page 61, activity 10. Listen and write the dates. Last year, my family went on a long vacation. We went to China first. We arrived in Shanghai on July 5th. We went on a boat and saw a lot of tall buildings. On July 9th, we went to Beijing. We walked on the Great Wall of China. We walked for about an hour. The wall is very strong and very long. On July 14th, we went to Korea. We went to Seoul and met some new friends. We had a party and they gave us some presents. On July 19th, we said goodbye to our new friends in Seoul and went to an island. We played on a beach. It was really fun. On July 23rd, we were in Japan. We saw a temple and ate a lot of fish. On July 25th, we took a fast train to Mount Fuji and climbed to the top. It was very hot at the start, but cool at the top. It was a really great vacation. Track 43, page 62. Activity 12. Listen and number. Hi, Lucy. How was the party? It was fantastic. I met a lot of my friends from school. Oh, good. And was it very cold? No, it was sunny but windy. Was the food nice? Yes, the food was great. We had fish and salad, then strawberries. Yum! Were there any games? Yes, we played soccer on the beach. That was fun, but I wasn't very good at kicking the ball. Was there dancing? No, but we sang after the meal. Some of the songs were very funny. Track 44, page 63, activity 15. Listen and check the things that were on the Mayflower. There was a doctor on the Mayflower. His name was Dr. Fuller. There were some hens and pigs, but they were the only animals. There were some books, and there were some hats and clothes for the cold winters in America. Track 45, page 67, activity 28. Listen and write. A fun party. I went to a birthday party at my school. The school was 50 years old. Parents and grandparents came to the school party. There were drinks and food. We ate a lot. The teachers sang and we played games outside. In the evening, we danced and talked with friends. 
The bakery in our town made a very big cake and gave it to the school. It was a fun party. Unit 7. School. Track 46. Page 68. Activity 1. Listen and write. The first lesson at school was easy. The second and third lessons were difficult. There was an exciting game in the fourth lesson. Lunch was boring. The lessons after lunch were interesting. In the last lesson, we read some poems. Some were funny, some were romantic, and some were scary. Track 47, page 68, activity 2. Listen and write for Maddie. 1. Our school book last year was Dinosaurs. It was boring for me, but my friend liked it. 2. My mom has a book called Summer Love. I read it too. It was a very romantic story. 3. Our school book in the summer was Anna and the Aliens. It was funny. 4. My first English book was The First Book of Words. It was easy. 5. Our teacher's favorite book last year was Fun with Numbers. It was difficult, but I like math. 6. Our school book in the spring was The Adventures of 009. It was exciting. Track 48. Page 70. Activity 8. Write. Then listen and circle T for true or F for false. Last week was a fantastic week. P.E. and geography are sometimes boring, but last week they weren't boring. Geography was interesting, but it wasn't easy. History and music were fun. Math was very interesting. Science and computer science were both very easy. There was an art lesson on Tuesday. I usually like art, but this week it was very boring. Track 49, page 70. Sing. Math, science, history, P.E. art, geography. A lot of subjects every day. Is school boring? No way! Last year math wasn't easy The lessons weren't always fun But now I can do all my homework Math is for everyone Math, science, history, P.E. art, geography A lot of subjects every day Is school boring? No way! Last year P.E. was boring P.E. lessons weren't my thing But now it's my favorite subject I can play soccer and swim Math, science, history, P.E. art, geography A lot of subjects every day Is school boring? No way! Track 50, page 71, activity 10. Listen and circle. On Monday, Dan's homework was computer science, and on Tuesday, it was history. On Wednesday, his homework was science. Dan doesn't like science, but the homework was interesting. Thursday's art homework was easy, and on Friday, Dan had music homework. Track 51, page 73, activity 16. Listen and write. And then we went to the United States, and I went to school there. Were you happy at your new school? 
No, I wasn't. It was very scary in a class with lots of other children. Were your teachers good? Yes, they were. But the math and English lessons were too easy, and the history and geography lessons were too difficult. What was your favorite subject? P.E. I was in the basketball team. It was very exciting. Track 52, page 77, activity 27. Listen and write. My favorite subjects last year. My favorite subjects last year were English, PE, and science. English was good because we read a lot of romantic poems. Science was difficult, but the teacher was very good. Her classes were interesting. She's my favorite teacher. P.E. was fun because I'm good at sports. Wednesday was my favorite day because we played sports all afternoon. P.E. was easy because there were no tests. Unit 8. Entertainment. Track 53. Page 78. Activity 2. Listen and match. Hey, Emma, look at my magazine. Do you know these people? Nicole Kidman. Hmm, is Nicole Kidman a singer? No, she isn't. She's an Australian movie star. What about J.K. Rowling? Is she a movie star? No, she isn't. She's a writer, a British writer. What about Rafael Nadal? Is he Spanish? Yes, he is. He's a Spanish tennis player. And is Lionel Messi Spanish too? No, he isn't. He's Argentinian. He's an Argentinian soccer player. And then there's Beyonce. Yes, she's an American singer. I want to be a singer too. Track 54, page 79, activity 4. Listen and match. 1. Where is she from? She's from the United Kingdom. Two. Is he from Brazil? Yes, he is. He's Brazilian. Three. Is she from Egypt? No, she isn't. She's Italian. Four. Where is he from? He's from China. Five. Is she from Argentina? Yes, she is. Six. Is he from Egypt? Yes, he is. He's Egyptian. Track 55. Page 80. Sing. On Friday, I was a cowboy On Thursday, a Spanish king In June, I was a waiter And a sailor in the spring I'm an actor, yes, an actor Acting's the life for me I'm an actor, yes, an actor Acting's the life for me Last year I was a scientist And a soldier, that was great I was a famous British spy In 2008 I'm an actor Yes, an actor, acting's the life for me. I'm an actor, yes, an actor, acting's the life for me. I get up at five in the morning. 
My days are very long, but a life in movies is exciting. That's why I'm singing this song. I'm an actor, yes, an actor. Acting's the life for me. I'm an actor, yes, an actor. Acting's the life for me. Track 56, page 81, activity 8. Listen and number. Number 1. This is the girl who is walking her dog. Number 2. These are the girls who are playing badminton. Number 3. This is the boy who is catching a ball. Number 4. This is the boy who is throwing a ball. Number 5. This is the girl who is kicking the ball. Number 6. This is the boy who is running. Number 7. This is the girl who is wearing a big hat with her country's flag on it. Number 8. This is the Italian man who is selling ice cream. Track 57. Page 82. Activity 10. Read. Then listen and number. Number 1. Well, we have an exciting game here today. The Spanish player Miguel Lebar is playing the Chinese player Li Chan, and it's five games all. The two men are playing fantastic tennis. The game, I think, will... Number 2. Last year, you were a king in your first movie. Now you're famous all around the world. How do you feel about that? Well, I don't think about it very often. I'm an actor, yes, but I'm a schoolboy too. I do my homework, I play video games, I read books. Number three. Where's the water? I'm thirsty. There isn't any clean water on the island. Oh no. Here, have some fruit. I've got them two days ago. Track 58, page 87, activity 24. Listen and write. My entertainment. My favorite entertainment is watching TV. I love watching movies at home. I often watch one movie many times. I like watching movies that are in English. My favorite actor is Johnny Depp because he's funny. I listen to music too. I download music from the internet. I love American music. I like playing many sports and play with my friends in the park. Goodbye. Track 59. Page 90. Activity 5. Listen and write. Captain Formosa went around the world in his submarine. He started from the United Kingdom on March 1st and sailed to Spain. He got to Spain on March 23rd. Next, on March 30th, he went to Italy, and then he had a long trip to the United States. He got to the United States on April 29th. He sailed down from the United States to Mexico on May 6th and then down to Argentina on May 27th. To end his tour, he went to Asia, first to China, then Korea, then Japan. He visited China on June 21st, Korea on July 2nd, and Japan on July 8th. Copyright Pearson Education Limited, 2012.